Hey guys, it's Anna. Bienvenido otra vez a mi canal. If you're new here though, what is up? So today I have another one of my planner and stationery hauls for you guys. I have found some amazing things over the past few months. So it's stuff from a few different places, mainly Amazon, not gonna lie. Also got some things from michaels.com since they're having their huge clearance. And it's like every day, every other day that I check their website, there's more markdowns and more markdowns. So I got suckered in. I did to michaels.com. Ordering from Michaels online is never a fun time, I will be totally honest, but for the deals I had, I had to try it. And Amazon, I will show you guys some of the things in better detail, better close up, I don't know. From Poshmark, I can't talk right now. Got a few planners from Poshmark, I am still waiting for one to come in the mail, and yeah, still waiting for a few items from michaels.com, so that's gonna be included in this video as well as soon as it gets here, whenever it shows up. But I want to show you guys my face, I feel like a lot of times especially when I do my planner and stationary hauls my face is in here so hi this is what I look like here's my haul video for my stationary and planner stuff so before we get on into it if you haven't yet I hope you subscribe to my channel if you guys enjoy hauls especially planner and stationary stuff so let's get on into the haul I'm gonna start out this haul with some discs we're just gonna jump right on into this it's gonna be kind of hard for me to keep all of the stores together but you guys know that I usually like trying to do that so you guys know I've done a video on it before if you haven't seen it I'll include Include that video down in the description box below and I do have some more sticker updates sticker DIY video updates to do so those should be coming but I got a ton more discs I had been wanting them for so long and finally I was gifted them so I'm so thankful these are just the happy planner but they're the metal discs so they're the expander ones so they're the largest ones the happy planner makes and then they are the metal ones I'm super happy about them um, I was gifted the pack with all the different colors and honestly I feel like I should just pick up a pack of these exact same ones from Michaels every single time that I go and have a good coupon but I guess like any coupon at all it's like they're only doing 20% coupons right now ever since everything started it's it sucks but whatever so yeah so I'm super excited about these I'm gonna put them on my sticker books but then you guys I discovered because these are the expander discs and they're even larger than the biggest size disc you could get from Staples but I discovered another brand that has even bigger discs and I'm so excited about them. I got them from Amazon. They are the tool brand. Why did no one ever tell me that this was like a thing and that these existed? Why? Why am I just now finding this out? Why did I have to do this myself? But these are ginormous. So they are two inch, two inch discs. I can't remember how much they cost. They weren't too bad. I got literally six containers or things of these because they come with 12 in total and the majority of my sticker book DIYs that I've done are the classic happy planner size which only need nine discs so I counted it out because I'm a psycho and I realized that with the 12 you'll always have three left over if you're using classic size so if you order three or wait yeah so if you order three sets of this from Amazon you can actually put together a total of four classic size planners or whatever so I ordered six so that it worked out um, it's just a tool custom note take it but these are huge you guys huge I love these. I do want this size. I use basically like all different sizes of the Happy Planner discs except for really the like teeny tiny ones but sometimes I do use those for other things. But for my sticker books for the most part they need large discs because I have a lot of stickers if you guys haven't seen. But like look how much larger those are. So insane. And I've already put some in some of these extra large ones in some of my planner sticker books. Like no lie you guys like there's one two there's three. <laughs> four five six I literally ordered six of these but then that way I have six seven eight classic size sticker books planners you know what I mean but still I love these happy planner discs so much the metal ones are so nice they're so pretty these are just plastic but had to mention these because they're awesome I can't believe no one told me these existed and I had to figure it out myself but it's okay it's fine <laughs> grab all these out of the way and I just have them in this little box that I got these ones in these containers are just like take up so much space. Don't forget the one that's like in the packaging right here in the front. 
So I guess I'm just going to stick with stuff that I got from Amazon for a second. So I showed in a haul the other day that I had gotten that pop-up thing from Staples for my post-it notes. And so I got some different post-it notes to put in there because the yellow ones were just not the aesthetic that I needed for my desk. So I picked up just this little set. I already split them in half with my Madre. It just came with double. So basically you're getting one, two, three, four of each color. These are so nice. They're the pop-up ones, so it opens on both ends. It's not the post-it brand, but they're still sticky notes. It's the same thing. Pop-up self-stick notes. These are nice. They're not too harsh on the eyes because they're pastels. I'll probably be changing out my little pop-up thing with these, but I did also pick up white sticky notes. Did I get these from Amazon too? Oh, I did. All right, so these are also from Amazon. I wanted white sticky notes. I realized the other day, because I was looking for white sticky notes, I don't really remember what I wanted them for, but I wanted white sticky notes and realized out of all the sticky notes that I have, like all the little shape ones and cute ones from like Happy Planner and all that, <laughs> I didn't have plain white ones. Ordered a pack from Amazon. Again, none of this stuff was like too pricey or too bad. I think I got two. Oh, they had four. Again, it's just the pop-up little kind of sticky notes because that's what I need for my container. So I want to show you guys those first and then I'll show it to you in the little container. But I want to show you one more thing that I bought for in there. Well, from Amazon also, and I'll probably show them again in another haul because I know that I ordered some more today or maybe I'll include in a little a snippet of it. I'm just waiting for them. They're literally out for delivery right now. But so this is the little container thing that I had gotten from Staples the other day. I showed it in my other haul. Why does it look like it's got so much dirt down in there already? Love this thing. And I realized you can actually get this from Amazon as well so I will definitely include the link for this because I did find it on Amazon it was only like ten dollars on Amazon but so here's my white sticky notes in here so white and then I also ordered the post-it it is post-it brand but I took it apart so that it was plain in there just the little page flags so I ordered some more of these I will include a little of it once they get delivered finally um and I'm gonna switch these out and I'm gonna switch out some different ones for right here too and then I'll show you guys what it looks like when it's all done but I take off the backing of these I would do it for this one too but I just don't feel the need to. I'll show it when I receive the other ones that are here in a little bit, a few hours, I guess. I take off the backing so that it doesn't say posted. It's just plain in the back. And then that way you can change these out and use any page flags in there. Just love that. Still from Amazon, I caved and I bought these dot markers. My mom bought these a while ago, or maybe I bought them for her or she got them from Amazon. She got a different pack of them. And when she got them, I was like, okay, I don't need those, right? <laughs> but I caved and I got them. So there's a few different versions and colorways of these dot pens, but basically they're just little circles and they just make like perfect little dots. But I wanna use these for like color coding in my planner. These were a little bit pricier than what I would prefer to pay for markers, but I did get a larger set of them and I kind of want them all now. It's really bad, I know. But so, um, I don't even know which colorway this one is. It's the one with the number 36, 34, 301, just these colorways there. I just felt like this was like the best assortment of colors to start out with. I don't really want to use my post-it note, but I guess we will use one of these little white post-it notes here. So these are cool. They're double-ended. So on this end, you get one that's literally just like a little ball, and it just makes like a perfect little dot. So I want to use these in my planners for like when I have like a calendar layout and I want to like instead of using a ton of stickers, I don't use my stickers like that. I feel like that's such a waste for me personally to use dot stickers. Like I just, I can't get behind that. That's why I caved in and grabbed these markers because then I can just color code and like highlight different things or make lists or whatever with these little dots. I think it's so cute. This gray one is probably the one that I'm going to use like the most. This is in the color, I think it's the 091. Why isn't it on here? I don't know. But the other end is just a regular, ooh, like a really small fine tip pen, but you can write with the other end. And look how thin it is. Oh, you can't see it with that color. But I figured I'd use the gray and probably like these ones right here the most right now because they're more of like the neutral shades. So you get that end that makes the little dots. And then the other end is just a really small. Let me use one of the darker colors so you can see how the pen writes on the other end. This one's nice too. It's like a dark blue. There! Can we maybe see that? It's really thin. Love it. Oh, and I just messed up my nail polish. Had to zoom it in a little bit. But sticking with pens. So these are ones that actually my mom picked up and I'm not sure if she got these from like TJ Maxx. She might have actually got them from TJ Maxx or Michaels or something. 
something. I am not sure. I've had these ones before and I could have got my own pack and I actually should have when we were at the store. I don't know what I was thinking. I think I was just grabbing other stuff. So I was like, no, I don't need those. But she gave me one. It's just the American Crafts Pre Precision Pen. And this one is in the size three. Fine tipped for multi-purpose writing or acid-free, fade-proof, waterproof, non-bleeding. And look at me using another one of my post-it notes. You see this? Okay. It's really fine. And you guys know that I use smaller planners, like my pocket size and my A6, so my inserts are smaller, and sometimes I just like a thinner pen. This is just the Sharpie S-Gel pen, and it's a 0.7 pen. I don't know anything about this. Again, my mom got a pack of these, and she gave me one, so let's see how this writes. It's okay. I don't know what the hype is about these or like what is supposed to be so good about these ones, but it's all right, I guess. It's nice looking. Love the aesthetic. Cool Sharpie. And then we got another one of these Micron 005. So this is a 0 .005. Super small. I'm telling you, I love super, super fine small pens. Love these for writing in like my trackers, especially in like my pocket size, even my A6. Just if I have smaller inserts, it's just nice. Love these three pens that my mom was nice enough to give to me. I picked this up from Amazon. It's literally just like a clear little like paper holder thing. Like I think technically it's like a sign holder. It came as a set of two, but I got these to hold post-it notes on my desk. Get this out of the plastic. It's literally just an acrylic little sign holder, but the size of this I think is perfect. I think it came in a set of three because I already have one that I'm using, but I literally got this just to hold my post-it notes on my desk. So when I finally do like a tour, like an office tour or whatever, I'll definitely show you guys what it looks like on my desk but it just sits there like this and holds my little post-it notes i think it's super cute it doesn't take up too much space all you're really seeing is your post-it notes <laughs> and like i said i have so many so i want to kind of use them more because i feel like i'm just really hoarding a lot of my cute ones especially from like happy planner i just want to use them up so i got some of these to hold onto my sticky notes i did this before in the old house but it was like a bigger one and i honestly can't find it so i just ordered some more from amazon and they weren't too pricey so it wasn't that bad but so i think i might have shown some of these before actually because I ordered some of these and gave some of these to my sister. But so I picked these up from Amazon. Love these. They're the transparent page flags. And they come on like these little organizers or like these little ruler things, like a little dashboard that they're sitting on. Love these. There's so many different like vendors or like sellers on Amazon that have these, but they're really, really nice. It looks like for the most part, all of mine are the same exact colors. I have seen other people buy them and show them. And sometimes the colors are off or like a little off, even if you order from the same person from Amazon. But all of mine look the same. These might be from two different people. I don't know. It came as a set, I think with like one of these and then with these also. I already gave some to my mom, but I need to see which ones I gave her because it just seems like I have a lot happening right here. Maybe she doesn't have a pack of these. So it also came with these, which I really like. Same concept, just a little bit different style of a page flag. So you get these ones also that look like that. I'm pretty sure it came at least like the link or the what I ordered. I do like these also. I use these more as like tabs or like dividers in my planner more than these really. I feel like these are more ones I would put on a page or use as like task flags, task cards, stuff like that, but love these and the price is pretty great. And these ones were just a smaller version, but same thing. So now it looks like we're going into the stuff that I got from Michaels. I placed an order from michaels.com again, and I really, I hope this time I actually learned my lesson to not order stuff from michaels.com. It is the worst. I don't know what's going on. I ordered maybe like 20 items, and it seems like they shipped out every single item separate. It's the weirdest thing, and I need to check my order because I think I'm still missing stuff from it. It was like something got canceled from my order, but saying that like it was either out of stock or canceled. But when I went back to the website the other day, it's still in stock. Like I could still add it to my cart and purchase them. So it was canceled for some reason. I don't know. It's weird. Don't recommend ordering from michaels.com. A few things that I ordered from online and we did go in store the other day also. This is kind of a mix of both. I think these are ones that I ordered online. So I tried really hard not to look at these sticker books because they kind of like, they're by the brand Craft Smart from Michaels, which is the same brand as the paper pads, the big paper pads, or like even the smaller ones. But so these stickers basically match those paper pads, which I think is kind of cute. So you guys have probably already seen these, especially if you've been into Michael's at all but these were on clearance in store and online obviously but I think these ones I ordered online so happy I got these I got two books of the seasons and holidays my mom did go through this too and she took out a few pages I think she took out this page from the other one so I shared this one with her and she just took out the pages that she wanted but 
I love these. They're so nice. You guys know I shouldn't be buying stickers, but I'm a sucker for stickers. And sometimes it's nice to add in something a little bit different with my Happy Planner stickers just to kind of change it up or I don't know. It's just nice. Oh, maybe I grabbed one in store the other day. So I have a total of three, but I think when I placed my order on the website, I either bought two of everything or three of everything or four of everything, depending on if I thought my mom would want some or not. And depending on how many extras I wanted, you know what I mean? So I got this one from in store the other day. So it's the same brand, same concept. I don't think this one matches a paper pad, but maybe it does but this one's super cute i wish i had found another one of it it is the life's biggest moments i think this is super cute so i guess if you start from the front it would be things like your birthday and then it's got like your marriage in here buying your first house stuff for your baby i mean i'm not having a baby but it's just nice it's got so um like milestones or whatever that you would go through in life for your kids your family it's cute i kind of wish i had one other one of these but i haven't found it and i think they're out of stock now on the website which is sad but sure I only found one Christmas one in store and I think I missed out on them on the website so I don't know Michael's website honestly is terrible not gonna lie but this one I am so in love with like I think we get a lot of use out of these here when I start decorating for Christmas excited for that and I think that's all I got from those types of sticker books I think I kind of touched on these the other day so funny speaking of dot stickers and how like I cannot waste dot stickers I did get these from Target the other day like I said I think I mentioned them in a different video also the other day but I'm not really sure um but I love these and these are transparent sticky sticky what am I saying transparent dot stickers from Target from Target guys so these are really nice you get three yeah you get three Three sets or three sheets in each. I'm not really sure how much they cost. I think maybe they were four or six dollars. I don't remember. Um, but they're nice and they're transparent. I already gave my mom a sheet of those. I need to give her a sheet of these ones. We will not be using these crazily, especially now that I have those markers. I'm so happy I have those dot markers now. All right, but so back to stuff from Michaels. I can't believe I found this in store. So they're having their like huge clearance clearance event at michael's i say that because like the stuff isn't really marked down it's at least at my stores i can't even get to, get into it but it's like they didn't actually mark anything down it's weird but i wanted this when halloween rolled around and they sold out so fast the bling stickers <laughs> so it's just the cat i wanted this so bad but i ended up getting it for a super super low price i think i paid 59 cents for it they originally had it at 5.99 no 59 cents is what I got this for. The other day, clearance. I ordered these sticker books from online because we just could not find these in store. I remember I told my mom about these. These were the sticker books that I was talking about in a different video a while ago that I mentioned them to my mom and she wanted them so bad, but we could never find them in store. It was the weirdest thing. So these went on clearance and I ended up buying um, a set for me and a set for my mom. Is this attached in the back? So the set comes with two. It's the brand Once More With Love. Um, they're just little sticker books. So you can put your stickers on these sticker sheets and travel with these if you want. They're just cute and they were on clearance so I got them. I think they originally had these maybe $5.99 or $6.99 and I think I got them for like $2 a piece and then you get two books per one that you buy. So I got two books and my mom got two books. They're cute. Once more with love. I think this brand is cute. Some more stuff that I ordered from or got online or in store of that brand is just a ton a handful of stickers so again i don't know what happened i either ordered stuff in sets of two three or four maybe i only got two of these but also they could just be missing <laughs> from the order because michael's is crazy you guys might have already seen these though it's the same brand the once more with love these were on clearance so i bought them whoa whoa whoa, whoa. okay what's happening here don't mess up my sticker book but i am a sucker for clear stickers because oh, what is going on here? Oh, the whole outline like came off. <gasps> okay, didn't lose any stickers, good. Because clear stickers I can add to vellum or acetate as well to spruce stuff up. So that's why I really, really like clear stickers. But this book decided to come apart, so that's cool. But these are super cute. This brand's cute. And I always love getting letter stickers, especially clear ones, because I use these to make my dividers a lot, to label my dividers. And then just a ton of quotes and just little pictures. We love food don't we and coffee 
always. So this is just the same one. Looks like I only got two of these. I don't know if that's what I ordered, but that's what I got. That's what I have here. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure I already gave her one of these. I think I ordered four of these and gave her one already. It's the same brand. They were on clearance, which is why I picked them up and got a handful of them. I don't remember exactly how much I paid for them, but they were on clearance. So it's the Once More With Love, and it's just the like chore books love these they're so cute i love the colorway of them they're just done so nicely they have a holographic finish to them foiled so cute love these little books i should have got more of these and if i find them in store i will definitely pick them up but i feel like these are going pretty fast these ones i it has an in-store sticker but these definitely got shipped to me in the mail which is weird so it's like i don't know if i'm receiving products from stores and that's why they're only shipping out like one item at a time it's weird because it looks like someone picked this up off the floor like the merchandise like the shopping floor i don't know what i'm trying to say you know what i'm trying to say like in store <laughs> but yeah so this one's cute too we love it's the same kind of dealio as like the shine sticker studio but you guys know how the collabs go at michael's it's a collab with the once more with love we love it the other day i only have one here to show because my, I, I didn't want any of these my mom had been looking at and we would make fun of these every time we went to michael's it's literally just like a washi card but they were trying to sell these for five dollars it says 3.99 but i'm pretty sure they were 5.99 a piece anyway like, anything more than 50 cents for this is crazy but so they were getting clearance to a dollar but I think they were actually ringing up less than that because my mom got like a handful of them So I just want to show that those are to be found these I picked up in store So these are just some happy planner Inserts I found these in store. I had been wanting these but I just can never really justify buying inserts from the happy planner because I don't use disc bound as my planner and it's like if I were to use happy planner pages it's really just to glue down my stickers so I reuse planners that I buy so that I have all the parts that I would need to build my sticker books if that makes sense if you know what I'm saying you know what I'm saying but these ones I did really like it's just the tracking of your social media and everything they're cute ever since they came out I honestly wanted them but I just couldn't really justify it they were originally $5.99 if you can see on the sticker right there but they were clearance to a dollar so I picked up just two of these we'll see how they go and if I really like using them because I did also just buy printable inserts to put in my ring bound planners because I use ring bound in spiral but i don't know i picked these up um and then last thing oh actually a, a few more things i ordered the other planner that i wanted i said i told you guys there was like one more cover that i really really wanted from recollections that i could change it out i got this literally just for the cover okay it was on clearance too so <laughs> This is just a 18 month. You guys know I've already, I already have my planner, but I just wanted this cover. I, I don't know what to tell you. I wanted the cover. So it's literally nothing new about it. It's actually the same exact colorway, I think maybe, as the one that I bought, but I DIY'd mine together. You guys know. I got this on clearance literally just for the cover. And then the last things though that I did get were these planners so i ordered these also from the website um because i showed in that other haul the other day that i had ordered or i found let me back this up a little bit sorry this planner is huge it's ginormous and you can kind of see some of the stuff that's on my floor over there but so that other haul of um, planner stuff that I showed you guys the other day I talked about how I bought that planner just so that I could give the spiral to my mom for her sticker book but it wasn't wide enough to hold all of the pages of stickers that she has so I ordered these from the website because we just couldn't find them in store anymore since they started to get clearanced out so this is the 18 month spiral planner it's the super large one it's the nine by 11.5 it's ginormous but she really just needed the coil and this is the only one i think they were selling out pretty quick on the website also so i just picked one that was like 18 month because i figured it would be thicker the 12 month is what i bought before and it was too small so i needed 18 months so i just picked one out really but i mean it's nice in this thing if you're actually using this as your planner it is really nice it's got really cute stickers in here too which i think she's keeping the stickers because i don't really i have so many of these stickers and these ones are pretty large and I know she likes larger stickers and I'm kind of more into like smaller stickers not gonna lie um so there's a few pages of that it's just a normal planner this one though it comes with the folder regular folder it doesn't have the page of the sticker paper but that's whatever I like this one though because it is really neutral so all of your tabs are black and I think there's like just a little bit of color it looks like it's just like a purple but it's still pretty neutral that's so pretty 
So love this planner, but I really only got it for the spiral and she'll probably, I wonder if she'll keep this cover. She probably will. But so I got two because she has a lot of pages full of stickers now. So this is just the other one that I grabbed that was also that I figured would have a bigger diameter of the coil because this is an 18 month planner also. It's dated July 2020 through December 2021. It's the memory keepsake. I love this cover. I'm going to keep the cover for sure. <laughs> but it's a memory keeping book. So you get this little pocket in here. I think she's going to keep that too because I don't really need it. But this one's done really nicely too so if you use this as an actual memory keeper i think this is super nice so you got a few stickers i think those are like decor cards you get a little pocket i think she's just going to keep the pocket too because she's using them for her stickers but these are nice and then you can just kind of decorate these as like a memory planner I'm not gonna lie i actually really like this huh and kind of scrapbook in here this is cute oh the christmas one's really nice you get a month in review I actually might have to put these on a smaller coil, like a thinner one that she's not using and make it just the 12 month and actually use this. <gasps> How cute would that be? Cause I have too many stickers. We all know that. I might do that. Oh my gosh, I didn't even like look through this. Hopefully she didn't want it because I kind of want it now, but I'll give her the coil and only do 12 months. Anyways, <laughs> we'll see how that goes. But so that is everything for this haul. You guys know this is like the best time I feel like for finding planner and stationary stuff because everything's going to start to get marked down and on clearance. The only thing is I'm kind of still trying not to go in store too too much because it's just it sucks man <laughs> right now is not the best time stuff is going to start going on super clearance here in the next few months so i'm super excited about it but i am trying to keep track of like the real things that i really really want to be on the hunt for so i don't go too overboard because i have like enough planner pages to last me forever i could probably build my own planner at this point for real with all the extra and old planners that i've gotten on clearance i hope you guys enjoyed this haul let me know in the comments below if if you guys have found any of these items or if you use any of these just what your guys' thoughts are in general about some of the stuff i showed love hearing from you guys give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and to let youtube know that you like seeing my videos so that hopefully you guys can keep seeing them don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't and hit the little bell notification so that youtube can hopefully alert you every time that i post a new video but yeah muchísimas gracias for watching este video and i hope to see you guys in the next one bye guys